Hare Krishna. In this band commercial, I will talk about two reasons to buy a new book called Women, Masters or Mothers by Bhaktivikar Swami. So, first reason to buy this book is uh, if you like conspiracy theories. Uh, many devotees uh, still enjoy conspiracy theories. So, they believe in lizards, uh, Freemasons who are controlling the world, they believe in UFOs, uh, bankers who want to exploit everybody. Well, I knew that bankers want to exploit everybody since at least when I first read Bhagavad Gita, it was very clear. And of course, the most stupid one, chemtrails. So if you want a <clears throat> real conspiracy theory, then ask yourself, why this book is banned in UK, USA, Vrindavan and Mayapur? There is obviously something in this book, which by the way consists mostly of uh, Shla Prabhupada's quotes, but there are there is something that some authorities don't want you to know. So if you know if you want to know what that is, well, buy the book. And second reason to buy this book is survival. Do we want to survive in Krishna consciousness? Uh, if you live in the Western world and you are in Krishna consciousness for quite some time, let's say 20 years, you probably noticed that uh, 20, that 90 percent of people fall off due course of time. Uh, in other words, it's very rare that somebody stays devotee for 15 or 20 years. So why that happens? Why majority of people fall off? I will offer you few explanations and you decide which one of them makes sense. First of all, why people fall down, they all of a sudden decide that they have to gamble and they go to Las Vegas. Does that make much sense? Nope. So next reason is uh, devotees uh, all of a sudden have big urge to visit meat shop and buy some steak. Not quietly. And then there is some urgent desire that devotees want to drink some wine. Uh, not quite. So we are left with a so-called fourth regulative principle. That is the reason why most people fall down. But how this fall down happens? Fall down through illicit sex happens if you don't know the principles of attachment that work in this material world. If you don't know how to protect yourselves, protect yourself. In other words, if you don't put yourself in a situation where you can fall down, then you will not fall down. Fall down doesn't happen just like that, co by coincidence. Fall down happens because devotees are not careful. Therefore, this book explains how to behave, how to become gentlemen, as Shla Prabhupada said, how to rise above the level of cats and dogs. This crucial knowledge is required if you want to survive in Krishna consciousness. So, how many books should you order? In Europe, I can give you addresses of some smugglers. You can contact me over Facebook or email. Uh, but you should order at least uh, 10 or 20. I mean, you need one for yourself. That's obvious. Then uh, you need one for your wife. She, may, she might become more chaste or more humble. That's a definite opportunity. Then you need one for your kid. Who knows? When he grows up, he needs to know how to stay in Krishna consciousness and maybe the book will be banned completely. So then you need one for backup if you lose a copy. And then you need one for your best friend and one for temple authorities if they are sahajya or they encourage, encourage free mixing. Uh, then you need one for a junior devotee who read at least Bhagavad Gita, who knows something about philosophy of Krishna consciousness. Don't uh, distribute this book to people who don't know anything about Krishna consciousness. Uh, it, this book is meant for devotees, actually. Then uh, you need one book for defense. That means you keep it in the car. 
if some uncultured Mataji approaches you and she wants to crack jokes with you, then you just uh, sell her this book. And the last one, uh, you need to put it somewhere in the house, in some special place. You can consult Vastu expert who will tell you exactly where do you need to put it and that will give out positive vibrations in your home. So 10 books, it's minimum, order 20 if you can. Save yourself, save, save your family and save as many devotees as you can because you will not hear this knowledge in ISKCON lectures or festivals or anywhere else. Thank you very much and Hare Krishna.